A very special morning today. The Uper Goddess is showing us how to make a sweet treat perfect for the summertime. It is also the last time that Ansley will be joining Lori in the kitchen. Good morning, ladies. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Good morning. Today Hi. is my last day, my last day with Lori, my last day with TV6. So it's kind of bittersweet, but we're going to still make this morning fun because that's what we do. Did I turn you into a youper? Well, maybe. Can I? <laughs> is that allowed? I know I wasn't born here, but can I, I take that title back with me? I said I was turning you into a youper goddess, right? <laughs> Yes, yes you were. Well, this morning we're making citrus butter cookies. Yeah. Uh, if you want to be healthy, don't eat these because, promise, they're not very healthy. Well, this part's healthy. Yeah, there's... But there's a pound of butter in them. <laughs> and sugar, but it's fine. It's sugar, whatever. yeah. It's fine, it's fine. Yeah. All right, we'll show you how it's done later in the hour, so stay with us. Reporting live at Ishpeming, Ansley Watson, TV6 News. All right, thank you very much, Ansley and Lori. We'll catch up with you again in just a little bit. I don't know, I think that as long as all the ingredients in the cookies are the real thing, then in the end, it's still healthy. Yeah, if you're looking for a simple yet refreshing cookie recipe, well, this morning, the Uber Goddess is showing us how to make citrus butter cookies. Lori and Ansley Watson in the kitchen to explain how they're made. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Well, since Good it's morning. my last day, yeah. Lori was like, well, what do you want to make for your last day and yeah. whatnot? And I was like, well, lemon desserts are my ultimate favorite other She's than like ice cream and lemon. chocolate lemon is up there as well so she went above and beyond and we're doing this ultimate citrus cookie yeah it has a pound of butter she's not kidding but you actually get like 40 to 50 cookies oh okay so if you make sense. them well we made them a little some big some small <laughs> <laughs> but um the batter is just you know always when you're making cookies have your butter at room temperature because it would be a nightmare if you had, you know, your butter just right out of the fridge. You could. So never that's the trick. Yeah. Should you not melt it in the microwave or anything? No, you don't melt it. Oh. No, just. That's probably my issue. <laughs> <laughs> you don't melt butter. Okay. Oh, okay. You have it room temperature, so it's nice and soft, and then you really whip like your sugar, and your egg. This only has two egg yolks. This batter. Oh really? So um, it has four cups of flour, and you use the the zest and the juice from a lemon and a lime. So it's a tablespoon of each. Yeah, I was over here. Of zest. Zesting away, we yeah. got our this poor guy. tablespoon of Let's juice destroy. of each one of these. And um, four cups of flour. And I always put a little bit of salt, even though I use salted butter. So that's I not too use, much salt then? No, you tasted them. Hey? Oh yeah, that's true, they're delicious. That's good. So you're gonna bake these about 12 to 14 minutes till they turn a little brown mm -hmm. on the bottom because they didn't really turn brown on the top. No, but check it. Yeah, it's they're perfect. nice. And then an icing goes on top of these, right? You're yep. making a homemade icing. Yeah, icing. when we come back, we're going to put um, a coconut. What? Lemon lime icing. This is like everything tropical. It Are we is. going to the beach? Are you taking me to the beach? Well, I am because that's what you like. So <laughs> it's your last day with me. <laughs> Thank you. You're so sweet. You're mm. so sweet. But anyway, um, this cookie recipe will be on youforgoddess.com okay. if you're interested. I mean, this is like a bite of summer. It really is. When you eat so this with the, with the icing and that on it, it is like you are... You're, you're transported to... You're in Hawaii. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it is awesome. <laughs> yeah. And you know, you could, um, if you don't like lemon or lime, you could use orange juice. Oh, I didn't think of that. You could do an orange spin on it. And um, you just use then twice as much. If you were just using orange, you would use two tablespoons of orange juice. Why is that? Because you, you divide oh, this oh, up. Gotcha. You know, we had one of each. That's so, true. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. You were at the Blueberry Festival. You met some pretty neat people yeah. there. Mike and Nancy. Hi. Who yes. else? And the and little boy. Chris and Karen. And I met this little boy. He must have been like six months old. He had sunglasses on and a little swagger hat. And I mean, he looks so cute. If you go to my Facebook page, you'll see a picture of him. Oh my god! Did gosh. he get to try some of your blueberry popcorn? He was a little young. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. I gotcha. don't know if he had teeth yet. Oh, oh he's that little. <laughs> he was little. Oh. Yeah. So <laughs> I didn't want him to choke. No. You know. All right. Well, when we come back, we'll bake these up, put the icing on top. It's going to be incredible. I already yeah. know. It. I'm so excited. I'm excited to make the icing. All right. Stay with us. Reporting live in Ishpeming, Ansley Watson, TV6 News. Okay, thank you very much, Ansley. We'll catch up with you ladies in just a little Yay. bit. They are very busy in the kitchen right now. Mm -hmm. This know, is yep. the final morning. Ansley Watson will be with us here at TV6. So she's with the Uper Goddess to show us a favorite recipe. 
Ansley and Lori, how are those citrus butter cookies looking this morning? <laughs> Oh my goodness, Andrew, they are, it's like summer in your mouth, completely. Huh. We, so my parents and my sister are here actually visiting yeah. with me for my last day. There Yay. they are, wave, say Yay. hi. So sweet of them, we have a live studio audience We do. Today. But anyway, they tried them, we all tried them, we all and like. And I made blueberry pie. Yeah, you've been spoiling us as always, but we all agreed it was, they're just to die for. They're yeah. so, so good. So we're making the icing to go on top we of them. We are, and it's like a cup of powdered sugar, two tablespoons tablespoons of cream of coconut and a little bit of juice whatever you need to get it to come together all right so I'll go and ahead and put the this other in. thing we're gonna do is we mix like a tablespoon each of lemon and lime zest and like about a tablespoon of coconut and we're gonna sprinkle that if you show that John how cool, pretty they look. they look like little confetti little yeah. fun sprinkles to go on top Isn't it fun? yes okay so I'm dumping the juice in here so to make it easier um, you can put your frosting in one of these squeeze bottles. Oh, that's super easy. And um, always put like something underneath or you'll have a mess. So you just kind of, you wow. don't want to go too crazy. The, ch the cookie's already kind of sweet. It is. Isn't that fun? I love it. And, you and then we're going to on top. Sprinkle. Is this thick enough? I feel like this is kind of... It's um, pretty watery, but that's all right. A little liquidy there. Whoops. It's all right. We can finish it up later. Yeah. Those look good. I'll thicken it up. If you do that, when you make it and it's too runny, just put more sugar in it. And you'll okay. be fine. I can do that. So um, so I brought a little gift for you, Lori. You did. Since you know how much we have fun together. And yeah. So I had to just give you one more thing to add to your kitchen. Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm excited. Oh. So cute. Don't read that yet. The back's kind of emotional. I wrote a letter. But isn't that, she loves rooster. She has rooster decor everywhere. So that's what yeah. I got for Lori. Oh, well, like I got it? something for you. Oh, you did? Look at what I did. Oh, no. <gasps> These are all our recipes. You're kidding. No. So. I love it. Thank you, you so much. You can take it with you on your journey through I life. will. And you know this will be good. I will definitely be making this for sure. For sure. You're going to have a happy husband. Someday. Well, eventually, if I find a boyfriend <laughs> first, that might be helpful. <laughs> so, yeah, that's most of the things we've made and a lot of things that you really loved. I love it. I love all your food. And I want you to take your cup. Oh, thank you. It's your cup you've used. Cup. <laughs> Guys, this has been a really, really special morning. Mm. Loved every second of it. This journey, being here in the UP two years, absolutely flew by. It's been absolutely incredible. So, kind of have asked for a better news team, a better... Yeah, Cruise. I really just, enjoyed it. Yeah. Now, Ansley, awesome. we are obviously going to miss you, but we've got a couple of questions before we say Good goodbye for sure. the last oh. time. First <laughs> off, I want to know, okay, so everybody who comes to the UP has mm -hmm. a UP bucket list. Mm -hmm. Did you get everything checked off on your UP bucket list? And Ansley, I love how you have... I almost oh, got everything right. checked off. And I want to ask sorry, you a question Andrew. before you continue, then we'll <laughs> let you take it away. I want to know if uh, what your favorite moment was of embracing the UP, too. My favorite moment in the UP. Are you kidding me? That oh is such goodness. a loaded question. Yeah. Okay, well, I know a lot of people ask me, what are my favorite live shots or what are my most memorable yeah. interviews? And mm -hmm. I can't even pick out like one particular interview yeah. that was just so incredible, so amazing. Mm -hmm. But it's mainly the people that I yeah. met. They're all so nice. They're, first of all, they're all strangers. I don't know yeah. me. I don't know them when I first meet them to interview yeah. them. And they thoroughly wish me the best of luck no matter where I'm going the, after the interview's over they're yeah. so kind to me they're so nice and so thoughtful and just that's what I've loved is just people have just really embraced yeah. me and coming to the UP and because yeah. I'm from southern Illinois so right. I, I had vacation up here when I was little but other yeah. than that I was very well, unfamiliar with the territory. Your smile will bring you far. <laughs> Thank you. It will. I appreciate it. And also I needed to shout out this um, older woman, we went to Presque Isle when I first moved here. My mom and I went and we were picking up rocks and this lady came down, started chatting with us, yeah. meeting with us, and so I told her that I just got a job here at TV6 and she was so excited for me. Didn't know me yeah. at all, but yeah. she was so excited. Later, like a few months later, she might be watching this morning if you yeah. are, I just want to thank you, but she called me a few months later, left a voicemail, and she's just like, hey, I've been watching, you've been doing great, I just wanted to encourage you to keep it up. and I. Lost a voicemail, so I could never call her back. So if you're if you're watching this morning, I just wanted to thank yeah. you and your encouragement. How Seriously, nice. it took me to cloud nine and the whole UP. Really, it's just it's really just embraced you're this a whole thing. 
Am I? Yep. I'll take it. <laughs> I will take it for sure. Oh, don't cry. Don't uh, cry. I've loved it so much. Lori, thank you for everything you've done with me and taught me and definitely been one of my greatest friends here for mm. sure. And I know people thank enjoy you. watching us together. I've heard that multiple times that we can't wait to watch the Uber goddess and see what she's making. So oh, thank you. you've made this really special for me too. Mm. So. I love you. Love you. Thank you. And for the last time. Good luck. Reporting live in Ishmael, I'm Ansley Watson, and we'll be Keep back smiling. with more of your TV6 Morning News after the break.